Hello guys, welcome to Medi Civil Logs. I am Pradesh. So today I am going to uh, give you a quick tip on how to buy some connecting tubes for your bathroom. So let's get into the problem quickly. So I got a connecting pipe from a local hardware shop uh, that near my house. So this is that uh, connecting pipe. So this connecting pipe was worth of some hundred bucks, hundred rupees uh, in INR. So this uh, actually I got it uh, six months before. The actual problem now is uh, it got uh, rusted, uh, the buckle which uh, they have concealed, the bolt and the tube has got uh, some gap somehow uh, because this connecting tubes are not easier to uh, way of flexibility uh, and this is under rupee stuff and uh, when we are connecting the, uh, the pipe which is coming from the wall, uh, which is com coming from the concealed wall to the uh, western toilet tank, uh, you see that it will be rugged and it will be very tight uh, it will be not flexible so this concealed uh, bolts are with the pipes has to take care of that it has to be flexible uh, like your knob here uh, it has to go left and right without breaking the concealed uh, uh, connection they have made but uh, due to this cheap uh, connecting pipe which i purchased it got broken uh, the concealed what they have done uh, got broken and even uh, one side is good you see the inside and the other side got rusted corrosion has happened uh, due to that corrosion uh, i got this gap so because of that this got broken and the water started leaking from the side of the gap between the bolt and the pipe so don't buy this so what i recommend now is after doing your research uh, uh, i would recommend to go for a stainless steel connecting pipes even if it, it is only recommended to use for a water geyser because of due to its hot water property the pipe this pvc pipe will melt they will say but it's better to go for uh, it's just under rupees difference between this pvc pipes uh, a good graded pvc pipe and uh, uh, stainless steel and i also got fascinated with this hello color rings actually this video is about this uh, yellow color ring this which makes us makes it fancy so this yellow the main purpose of this yellow color ring is uh, it is uh, you don't need a spanner or a cutting blade to i turn this bolt with that connecting uh, object uh, it's going to be a geyser uh, vault uh, input vault or it's going to be the western tank flush uh, input vault uh, so it makes life easier like that you can just go and rotate it and make it uh, tighten so these are fancy stuffs so now i will come to the actual agenda on the business behind this so this is a cheaper uh, you will get this from north india many cheap manufacturing uh, companies are doing this kind of cheap connecting pipes so the excess uh, plastics which they have they use that to make this kind of uh, uh, ring connecting rings uh, or the tightening rings so but when you go i buy it in another uh, branded pvc material itself now so that's called future uh, the company it's 260 or something i was amazed by the price uh, because i got it the same pvc for 100 rupees i could see that uh, they were uh, recommending i i got it from an uh, ibo uh, it's an wholesale uh, hardware and plumbing materials electricals uh, selling vendor they recommended to use that company uh, pvc because it lasts more than three years it seems so here uh, actually that uh, good companies uh, which is for giving you a genuine product uh, or not giving you these fancy things because it, this itself costs more and even this thing which comes with this, with this cheap material uh, you cannot take it uh, to an another connecting pipe and uh, connect it because this is concealed also it, you cannot remove it if, if you want to remove it you have to break it so once you break it you cannot use it on another pipe so that's also a disadvantage so i i see that if a nice company or a good company is not giving you this kind of uh, freebies uh, kind of cutting your plumbers uh, tips there because you don't need a plumber to come and connect this right you just use this itself and connect it yourself it helps you, you don't if, if even if you don't have a spanner because when you connect this with a uh, normal hand it is not easier sometimes that uh, rusted part of the pipe or uh, the other part of the pipe will not allow you to screw also so if you use this kind of some kind of support it allows you to screw so don't get fascinated with this kind of cheap uh, tricks they are selling with this pipe uh, the original products or the genuine product which cost more than 100 bucks than this local thing they don't give this because they know that if they give this kind of uh, freebies or some attaching uh, tools with the uh, with that kind of price tag uh, it's going to be lost for them and you can see that this buckle which they have done is also not good quality even in six months it's getting rusted and breaking then i don't know what is the purpose
purpose of manufacturing this so if you are by in uh, doing an uh, if, if you are asking a plumber to go and get a pipe and come without checking these things you are going to again going to lose an uh, uh, 100 to 200 bucks of rupees uh, in another six months so please uh, watch this video and take a useful information from this I have provided a nice good products, uh, original products uh, links, connecting type links in the description. You can you make use of that. What I would recommend is go for a stainless steel uh, which is of uh, grade materials. They say that grade is of uh, 3, 304 and 316 stainless steel uh, grade. So 304 will uh, also be sufficient for um, day to day bathroom use. You see that 304 stainless steel will help in uh, providing more resistance for rusting. Here, yeah, rusting is the main problem which has happened here. So that corrosion, it will reduce the chemical activity and the corrosion. So if you want to more uh, protection from the rust and uh, breakage, uh, you can go for a 316 grade uh, stainless steel uh, uh, connecting types. Also, I have given the links in the description. You can go and purchase it. Also, please avoid this kind of fancy things which comes in the local shop. Uh, the, the, the good material vendors are not providing this kind of fancy things. You need a spanner to tighten it and also uh, check for double buckle resistance uh, they, this bolt and the connecting pipe uh, has been buckled up okay so they have buckled up double buckle is another uh, essential thing they are providing so two times they are buckling it even one breaks the other side will not break kind of uh, protection they are giving so double buckle and 304 grade or 316 grade are the must for a connecting pipe so don't waste money on uh, low grade companies who are providing this connecting tubes or lose your money to rumbus so that's it guys i want to provide this information to you folks so it, i think this should be a useful video for you guys so don't forget to uh, use the links and buy it so i will catch up in the next video bye yeah.